Hello and welcome to episode 24. Right, let's kick off with this football tactics and glory. Today we've got Rotherham. We will also have, uh, who's that? Bristol City and we'll have Preston North End. Right, let's start the match. Let's see how we fare today. I have a feeling that some stuff's going to go down and we're going to be able to do whatever we need to do. But Kaku with the ball. Or Kuku, Kuku, Kuku. Rani, what's that? Ran, Ran, Ran Seaman. Ran, Ran, Ran Seaman. I think. He takes a shot anyway, but it's saved by our keeper because our keeper's amazing. That's what's so good about it. Manoy, been a right good player the, over the last three seasons. So I oh, ain't yeah, knocking him. So uh, yeah, Willows knocks the ball straight back to Wren. Wren. Wren, what a name, Wren. Wren. Takes a shot, goal. One nil down. Fucking typical one nil down. Fucking bullshit. Right. Up front with Hensman. Hensman. Ooh, saved by their keeper. Fascinating. Right, we've got a corner. And also one of my players, but I I'm gonna keep saying some of the high-end players. But um yeah, it's pretty astounding of how good we actually are and I can't believe it's only four days to Christmas but yeah it's all good fun Sorry, Neon with the ball. What's Neon gonna do? Pass it. Shoot it, I ain't got a clue what he's gonna do. Hmm. And they score. 2 0 down. This is not what I wanted to see early on in the uh, game. But I suppose it's worth noting that. It's quite sad. But we have a chance to at least try and get a goal back. Rotherham, yeah, like I said, they, these are the teams that I will lose to. But I do expect at least a, uh, a goal or two with the team. Just to say, you know, we ain't good enough yet, but we are good enough for everything else. This, this is where we uh, struggle now. Half time, yeah, see, look at that man. Ren scores twice by cannon shots. That's the problem. Our team's good, but it's not good enough for this league. I've noticed that. And it is quite sad. But we have a chance. We've upgraded our team, but what I need to do is I uh, sell high-end players to get the money in, so I can buy somewhat, somewhat good players. That's what I need to do, but it's getting the funds to then replace them players. I, mean, I can't afford hundred thousand, you know, hundred hundred thousand worth of player. They're gonna work like that. Uh, 
if I could get um, high-end players for cheap prices, then I would do it. But I can't see how, how that would work. I need proven players. I need players that can play the game. I need at least seven good players on the starting on the starting lineup. Players that can keep me afloat. Because I don't want to get re, re relegated just to come back up, just to get relegated again. I don't want to be a yo-yo team. I want to be a team. That can get promoted within two, three seasons of the league that they're in. Now I got promoted at the amateur league dead early. And now I'm in this league. My team ain't good enough for this league. But like I say, it's just one of them things. We need to score goals. And we are scoring them. If we've got a chance to dominate, we will dominate, but we are going to dominate Rotherham. We're going to be in mid-table. I need funds at the, at the end of every game. I need the funds in the team so I can buy the players that I want to buy. Yeah, some of the prices of the players are quite ridiculous. But I'm looking at players in, the, in our league that I want to try and put, uh, buy. And they're too expensive. Summer over to Ran Ransiman, Ran Ran Ransiman, or whatever. I think it's Ransiman, ain't really, that's how he's pronounced. Ridiculous name. But we need good players, and the players I want ain't going to come to the team. So I'm going to have to think long and hard about what team I'm trying to build. I need to think of awesome players that I can have in my team and I know I can dominate. Three now. And four time three now. The main score is a hat trick. Oh well, say so one thing I can do, sell my IM players to bring in young and cheaper players, that's fine, there's a lot I can do actually with this team, oh. I will sell my IM players, because I'm getting zero cash in at the moment, I can upgrade a player apparently, Oh, the goalkeeper. It's making that. Uh, on. Kill. Long pass. Roll back. See if I can sell any more players. I don't think I'm second. Right. Right, 
can I contact any of my players? Okay, I can't. Oh, it's before a match, right? Okay, let's see this match. Let's see how we get on with Bristol City. We should hope we get a point in this match. Brown. Twin. The two ends. Saved by our keeper. This is quite bad. So I'll try bar to them. <laughs> We're playing against me, former man. We can tackle him now because yeah, that, yeah, that good though. That's why we can tackle him so easily. He tackles us again. Dante misses. Her again, we tackle him, he keeps the ball. Hmm. it's going to take a look for a shot, he's going to score. Now, outside by our keeper, corner, corner to them. We have some good stuff. Defending the uh, the ball, but we intercept it regardless. Fascinating. Willows, Smith, Henson, Hensman, saved by their keeper. Come on. Score, yes. We won it up out of Bristol City. It's nice to see. Spectacular after the last game's loss, but we got this covered. Is that Hensman again, yeah. Saved by the keeper just to go, but it's all good. 
I've got these covered because we are awesome. Right, we've got a corner, so we should be able to shove some of their players that we can actually win. Are we going to do anything? No, they do defend quite well. Disappointed. Just slightly disappointed. That I couldn't get the uh, the goal sorted. Right, let's have a look what else we've got. Harlock. Harlock. Willows. Yes, we tackled him brilliantly. Bonus. Hensman, come on, get a second goal. Now, intercepted. If we can win 1 0, I'll, I'll still take the three points. But I'd rather score at least two or three goals to counteract the last game that we lost. So, yeah. I'm always looking for other stuff. This guy was good, but I'm glad I sold him. Because he isn't quite there for my team. Where Beckett, he was the man that did everything. And he got sold behind my back. And I could not re reinforce him to get back into my team. So, I am looking at selling high-end players, like I say. At the end of this match, I want to send some uh, scouts out. And I want to look for my team I want to look for players who, who can fulfill my team because I've got a few players I can sell and hopefully they'll be good 2-0 we scored again I think that may have been Gaip who scored but yeah I say this, this commentary on this game though, it looks like every other game, it's uh, hitting me because I am sorted out. I've sorted out my boost, so I've had that today, so I'm basically just sorting out stuff for Christmas Day. And I'm also looking at Thursday as well for stuff. So I do apologise that I am a bit scatty with my, uh, with my commentary on these games. But we should win the game comfortably. Well, I hope we can win the game comfortably. We are 2 0 up. 3 0 up now. I saw that by Hensman. Hensman, what a player. This guy's coming and now he's finding his feet in the team. And all you've got to do is have faith in your squad and the squad will do it for you. And that's one thing I have. I have faith in my squad. That's why we got promoted. Hands win, Gay Pens win. Yeah, we won 3 0. See, told you we should be able to win 3 0. Uh, and my team does not disappoint. I just get a little bit frustrated when, when I say my team's good enough to get these goals and we don't score them goals. And it's like, why can't we score? And now, out the blue, we're scoring goals left, right, and centre. I can't sell my goalkeeper at the moment. Because I haven't got a replacement keeper who's good enough for him. And he's level 31 now as well. That's what I'm saying. I've got to sell my star players. Because I still don't think my players are good enough for this league. So if I did that. Pardon me. Right. How much Oh, I can't sell players yet. Okay. Right. We should now... Hopefully, actually... Can, can I... I can do this very well. We are eighth in the league with 11 points. Two wins, five draws, three losses. Eight goals for, ten goals against, and minus two. 
So really, we should be in the relegation battle with our team. And how, how are Millwall top? See, we should. See, because they should, they should be top. Hall City should. Followed by Nottingham. Followed by Derby. Followed by... I think that's Brentford. And then Blackburn Rovers. Do you know what I mean? So there's one, two, three, four, five. At the top, let's say at the top five, they should be in the top five, but you know, but Millwall should be down where we are, uh, and then it'll be uh, from 14th then to seventh, who then should start, you know, seeing where the league is. But currently, we are doing well. Bloody hell. Everton, Wolves and Brighton. Wow. So you got promoted at the amateur league, got promoted at the third league, and that's why we're in the second league right now. Three seasons in. Can't believe in our three seasons that we've been here, we've actually got promoted. I would love to have played against Walsall and Shrewsbury though. That that would have been kind of cool, but maybe next season they might they, they might try and pop up. But I, I dare to be Bert, Burton Albion. Burton upon Trent, man, what a name! That's that's what the actual name is. Burton upon Trent, just in the West Midlands near near Walsall. <laughs> Bristol City though, versus where well, Bristol Rovers who are. Oh, just above us. We need to score two or three goals against Preston now. And our goal difference will go up. But, you know, needs must when we need to score goals. But hopefully we can get goals. Score. I know we've got Tabra. There must be two, then there must be two players the same. Hmm. dominating in defence. us quite easily we are failing to do anything in our defence can we do anything we need to defend and we need to play smart 
hopefully we can do something that's really, really good. Cute again with the ball. Like I said, I think, might, I think these will dominate us. If we can hold on for a point, then that's an added bonus, you know, another point towards safety. Win the game, that's three points for safety, but anything can happen in these matches, starting. Hensman straight at the keeper. Half time. We're doing quite well, considering that uh, we are all over the place with our team. Up and down, you know, and it's not the greatest thing. But hopefully we, we can turn this around and we can score goals. Here we go. I don't know if we're going to dominate. I hope we can dominate. We've got a lot of faith in this team. Corden, Corden with the ball, it's going to be their move now, they're running down towards us, Hewitt tackles but misses the ball completely and we still get the ball with Corden, Scored or somebody scored. That's a screen. Let's get two, two more goals. Let's get a plus in goal uh, for goal uh, difference. I don't like seeing a negative goal difference. Because I feel like I'm on feet for about a negative goal difference then. Because like I say, we're facing bigger teams than ourselves, so, so the goal difference will be slightly different. But we should be scoring six, seven goals against these teams. Because we are decent, we are very decent, we are very dominant, and we should really do well. Starting, still knackered he is. I might have to rest him for a couple of games. I think he's just too tired. But we'll have a look. We'll have a look next game. See if we can keep him. Uh, can get, keep him happy. I'll take one nil. At least now it's just a negative one on the goal difference. So 
uh, let's see how we get on. Another play upgraded, Starling. Starling might be upgraded here. It's gonna be fascinating, wouldn't it? We've got some, got some pennies. Yeah, I can upgrade two players apparently. Oh, sweet. So now, hopefully, Starling will be. Uh... Oh, what? I'm gonna put fun favorite on. Oh what? I'm gonna put that on. Yeah, Starling needs a lot of rests. Um, okay. Smith's actually slightly better. Okay. Can have a little minus one gold difference now. See, that's what I mean. We are doing brilliantly. Do one more game. Yeah, let's do, uh, let's do against these and let's do against Brentford. Right, let's beat Brentford. There's how we can score goals, lean. Tried. What's our team doing? Thinking, probably. Hmm. What's going on with this game? Trig. Goes one more down. Mm. Starting. Oh, it's, okay. Oh, who's it's playing the game then? Okay. Tiber. Takes a shot now. Needs to get a little bit closer. Okay. That's a hard tackle. Cook with the ball. Okay. Lean. Over to Pride. Pride's going to score again. Yeah, 2-0 then. Jesus. Fine, I seem to get a bit of tech out of me. I don't know what, I am going to tag style and I'll go for this. I'm going to bring on Smith. And I'm going to take, oh well, I'll put Banfield on. He's had a reload, right, so let's get some uh, some better players in this game. Can't say it's getting big shots off. Right. Hopefully, I can get these substitutes on. I'm expecting the substitutes to come on. They're going to score a third, aren't they now? Pride. Saved by our keeper. Right, substitutes. Boom. Substitutes are on. Their corner.
Let's just do default. Okay, fair. Right. Jig. Goal. Keeper saves it. Okay. That's kind of cool. I guess I don't. Can I even pass to him from up there? Oh, I can pass to Corden. What a throw. That's a nice throw. Corden. To Gabe. Come on. Nah, it's not going to work. No, couldn't get past him. Tackled too easily. Blimmin. Blimmin to... Woodcock, Woodcock. Trig, Trig goal. Saved by our keeper, okay. This is not too shabby. What a wank pass. Right, that's the uh, Up and over, come on. Yes, we got it. And I can't do anything anyway because now it's the end of my turn. And we keep the ball once. And we lose the ball that time to a harder tackle. Tillman with a nice little slide tackle. And we're 2 0 down at half time. Yeah. Smith stand fast stand fast to Gabe but can I I don't know at the moment Cook with the ball Do, but sorry, I'll tackle him. Right. Let's see if we can get there. We go, that's what I was after. Waste, waste of space. Keeper to Smith. What a waste. Do a tackle? No, can't even do a tackle. Keeper's out of position now. Uh, the keeper should be moving backwards. Uh, the keeper should move backwards. Hello, game. Keeper needs to go backwards. They're going to score an open net. The keeper couldn't even move then. That's bullshit. That's absolutely fucking bullshit. Do a power shot. Oh, pff. terrible. Can't believe that the keeper moves and you can have a fucking open net. That's fucking bullshit. Know what this is. Because the cable could fucking not move back to his spot. Pisses me off that does. Lofty pass. Fucking hell. Fucking terrible. Do that.
God. Smith not quite good enough there. Okay. Full time. We lost three nil. Back to minus four on goal difference. I ain't happy. We 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 fucking lose every fucking game that we come across now with the big teams. And it ain't it ain't good enough. Our team is not good enough. And now, Millwall fourth from Grace. We're still eighth, but it's not good enough. It really isn't. Anyway, I'm going to end this game here. I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, hit the bell for notifications. And until tomorrow, I'll see you all again. Bye.